All right, everyone, I am here. I'm ready to go see The Matrix Resurrections. I decided to resurrect my black trench coat from high school. I am very excited to see this. I have not seen any of the trailers. I haven't read anything about it. I'm gonna go in blind, and then after, I will record my thoughts and put them up. So I'm real excited. Let's go. All right. Walk into the theater. Let's speed this up. Trudy, help! I'm stuck in bullet time and ready to talk about the Matrix. Let's talk about the Matrix Resurrection. All right, so I didn't do it right outside the theater because I wanted to have my mask off. I wanted to make sure the sound was good, um, but I really liked it. Like, I'm, okay, so I'm not going to spoil anything because this will be a spoiler free, but I really did like it. It uh, has a lot of callbacks to the Matrix. It's got some good action. I mean, it's still a CG powerhouse. It's got some original characters from the original movies, uh, and it's, it's a clever story. I think they had a tough job trying to continue from the Matrix storyline, which kind of went off the rails by the third one, and this has enough of a callback to the original films that fans will be happy you have enough updates to kind of current technology and some current terms it still has a little exposition but not that much it's a little more streamlined it still has some cg heavy effects and the ending is it's interesting but it, it still leaves a little to be desired but that being said if you're a fan of the matrix you're gonna love this it's got everything you'd love about the original Matrix, and then some. Uh, and you can see it in theaters and on HBO Max, so you can pick whichever way you want. I definitely think you should check it out, and thanks so much for watching.